Hi everyone! It has been quite a while since I have posted. It's been four weeks or something, around four weeks, and I feel bad about it, but I just really wanted to take a break, and also these voiceovers are kind of hard to do, because I try and find a quiet space, but sometimes it's hard to do that. So I also had to find that, and today I just got lucky and I found one. <laughs> so. I am going to be posting it today, and I am doing a lion. This was recommended by Sanvani. I'm sorry if I said your name wrong. I'm, I, I'm really bad at reading names, but she really wanted me to draw a lion, and I also just looked at the comments, and she said that she wanted me to draw a bird. So I'll try and do that next, but I'm already starting to sketch another thing, so it might be not next video, but the next, next video. So I will try and draw a bird, although I'm not very good at drawing <laughs> realistic things. And this lion, I just have to say, it does not look good. It just, I just really wanted to do something fun. And you know how I said that I had to find a quiet space. Well, it got loud again, so I had to change locations. And if you hear water running in the background, uh, I swear it's a fountain. Uh, we have a fountain in our backyard, and that's currently where I am. So I just wanted to say that. So right now, I'm actually putting like a circus clown suit onto the lion, because I'm making this a circus lion. And back to what I was saying before, I said this is not a good drawing. I really wanted to just not care about how it looked. And I know that I'm not a good drawer. Like, I know that I'm really not a good drawer. But um, I just really wanted to do something fun. And it was kind of like little. I, like, it's a five-year-old's drawing. But I don't know. I kind of like it still, though. So I'm adding, like, the opposite color on the opposite dots because that's how some clown outfits are. And now I'm adding a tutu on the lion. <laughs> this is such a five-year-old drawing. But I really wanted to do it for some reason. That's what I felt like doing. And I don't know how I still like it, but I do actually still like it for some reason. <laughs> um, it's just something weird. <laughs> So, actually, I want you guys to name him in the comments. And whichever comment gets the most likes, then that'll be the name for him. Because I'm really curious what you guys are going to say about him. And, like, the name can say a lot about a drawing. <laughs> so, good luck. Um, now I'm drawing the face of the lion. And it's kind of small. But I made the circle for the face kind of small as well. So, yeah. <sighs> but I'm almost done. Almost done. But I keep messing up on the face. What the heck, man? I don't really know what else to say about this, man. It's just like, it's weird. It's funny. <laughs> But that's, that's not good. <laughs> I'm trying though. Oh, and I forgot, but I am using Procreate. And it's much easier to stay inside the lines. Because uh, for one, it has like a drop tool that I just use for the ball. So you can just drag a color and then it fills it in. And so that's helpful. And also you can do layers, so you can actually technically be outside of the lines, but it won't be able to show. So I definitely recommend this, although it does cost money. I think it's about $8 or something. But I think it was worth it because I do like to draw. And whoa, look at that. There's just random news that just came on. Yeah, so I kind of was confused. And it just looked kind of like too five-year-old-y or not five-year-old-y enough. Not really sure. Um, and so I just added like a little circus background. 
But honestly, I feel like I shouldn't have done that just because it was so much more work and I don't think the background did that much for the picture. So just tell me what you guys think about the background down below. So I'm just kind of drawing like a purple background and it's having like one of those sand circus rings or whatever. I don't really know what those are called. <laughs> just like the circus floor, I don't know. Um, and so now I have to fix all the little feet parts because I'm getting down to the details. Oh, and I just wanted to tell you, if you are thinking about getting Procreate, that you can't, you don't have a circus tool like you do on the other drawing app that I was using, but it does like, you can edit it so where you hold you make a circle and then you hold it there for a second and then you can make it bigger or smaller and then it'll put it in an exact circle or oval or triangle or whatever you were trying to draw. Uh, so that's good, but also bad because sometimes I'm trying to draw a circle and it thinks I'm trying to draw a square because I would draw it so bad. So that's the bad part about it. And look, I messed up on the eyeballs. I had to fix that, but it's all good. I fixed it pretty fast. And here are the results. And I honestly wonder what you guys think about it. And comment down below what you guys want me to draw next. Have a great day. Bye.